Hello, Destin. Uh, I'm Jabby Kawe, and this is a Char Kirk. Hi. Hi. I love you guys' head mics. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. very profound. We like, to prefer- we like to pretend that we're announcers for the NFL. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Or pilots. Or pilots. Well, take it. Uh, we just watched Short Term 12, and cool. from that from that to Glass Castle and now Shang-Chi, there's a recurring theme of broken and estranged families, and it made me wonder, how's everything with Destin? And what's inspiring these <laughs> children? <laughs> <laughs> and what's inspiring these choices? I do come from a big family. There's a lot of love in our family, but there's six kids and family family has always been a really important thing in my life. I love exploring the dynamics of the family because it happens to be the place where most of us have a lot of our emotional highs and lows. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, and speaking of family, uh, the portrayal of relationships in Shangxi, both family and friendship, they felt so authentically Asian to me and they reminded me of my own relationships with friends and family. And so I was wondering, where do you draw the line between authenticity and stereotype. I think stereotypes are broken when when you humanize characters or and make them surprising to somebody. And stereotypes become stereotypes because we see this the same type of thing over and over in cinema. We were trying in this movie to just surprise people by showing a, a reflection of of Asian characters that we know and love in our normal everyday day-to-day lives. Like I, I know people like Katie and Shang-Chi. I know people who remind me of Wen Wu and uh, remind me of Lee. And every character in this movie is so drastically different that I think it would be difficult to leave this film with the, the idea that all Asians are the same. Right. Yeah, totally. The fight scenes in Shang-Chi were some of the best that I have seen in a very, very long time, and I, I love fight scenes. I watch them regularly. And um, it made me wonder what was the development process for you in making these fight scenes look just as good as stuff we've seen in Hong Kong cinema. We hired a stunt team um, who was very versed, well versed in Hong Kong cinema. Um, our, our stunt team was led by Brad Allen, who was act- actually trained in, in Jackie Chan's camp, and he brought a lot of stunt performers and choreographers from that team. He also hired um, choreographers from mainland China who brought a very different style of, of, of wushu to the movie. And collectively, they, they put together some really amazing fight scenes that are reminiscent of Jackie Chan style like and Bruce Lee style fight, fighting to to scenes that can be described as beautiful and elegant and emotional. What was the dialogue like between you and Brad Allen in terms of like choosing camera angles? I know that like some directors are like, no, it's got to be my way. I got to shoot it this way. Oh, I mean, I am a, I, I find myself to be a student on set more <laughs> more often than not and i love hearing the ideas of people who have done things before and for for ages and are experts in their field that's not to say that there is not a dialogue back and forth as to how how best to to shoot a a a scene but with with a stunt team like brad allen's i was just i mean i learned so much about where the best placement of a camera is to to get a move and the choreographers are trained filmmakers they're not just kickers and punchers like they right. they also know the best camera placement to where you would get the most energy out of a kick and how to how to do a counter move to make something look three times as fast all, all of that it, it would it would be kind of silly to ignore your to ignore your choreographers because they they are a wealth of knowledge. Uh, just thank you so much for uh, taking the time to do this with us. I know you're doing a bunch of interviews and it could probably be very exhausting. So thank you so much yeah. for your time. Really appreciate uh, your insight on the process. Yeah, yeah my we pleasure. Had, we had such a great time watching the film as well, and can't wait to go watch it again when it comes out. Oh, thank you. Thanks so much. All right. Take care. Take care. Bye. Bye. Bye.